And we're back in the game with some more Rome 2 Total War playing as the Desert Kingdom of Kush. Or well, we will be just as soon as the game loads up. It is a rather large file. Right. It's been a few days since I recorded any of these. But as far as I remember, we are making very serious progress in expanding our kingdom. We do have to deal with a slave rebellion on roads, I believe. Uh, we're making over 13,000 a turn. Let's see who we are still at war with. Serenica and Rome. That's about it. Let's see if we can get any more trade going. Right, they're not going for any trade. Sardis, I think they're going to be our next target. My people are wealthy in intellect and do not need your goods to add to them. Namnities. That's fine. If you don't trade with me now, you will later. Let us use our Macedon. Enter, You're just not very friendly. Greetings. Speak plainly and without fight. Your good. Okay, Lugiai. I welcome you, worthy speaker. You always want an alliance, but you're not going to trade. We will gladly listen to your offers. All right, that's everyone. Now, here's those um, slaves. We do finally have an army here. We don't have any more movement points. Let's check our agents. You're active and you're active. And you're going after the Serenican Warlord. Or no, you actually... I think wounded him in the last episode. Alright. So, let's go ahead and end the turn. No, we're not going to pay you all that money, even though we have it. We do have some public order problems that we need to deal with. Right, you're only at war with the slaves. Um, you look like you're expanding, but no. Okay, a home for the afterlife. A noble from another house has recently passed away. His family asked us to build a pyramid for him so he may undertake the journey to the underworld safely. What should we do? Hmm. He can have a small pyramid. What's that worth? Five loyalty, 10% construction cost, all region. Ah, not good. 15% construction costs, all regions. Right, small pyramid. Right, you come out of Force March and go and do some public relation work. Uh, you look like you're happy there now. Oh, our home province isn't very happy. What can we do about that? To public order. Hmm. Are you going to add to public order? Nope. Right. That does help out with our trade agreements. How long? 23 turns. Okay. We'll be alright. Um, 
we've turned that around there and our culture is increasing we turn that around okay paratoinon our culture is dominant right slaves they're the problem Yeah, those slaves are actually moved away. We should be able to reach them. Yep. Night attack them. And kill them off. Yep, we have crushed the slave uprising. We are getting replenishment, so that's fine. Okay, let's spot over there. Looks like we're actually going to have another rebellion in two turns. That's not good. Our culture is going up. Right, left warriors. Yeah, we are going to at some point move into Anatolia, I think. So that's a good jumping off point to have some good units. Right. That's expensive to upgrade. We don't have that much food now. That's an extra two public order. We need to get some more food. Mias Hormos, are you getting any trade? You are not. We could convert that over, couldn't we? To this right. you're losing food but not affecting public order we gained food from that but then lose public order hmm. decisions decisions okay you 20 public order no negatives and that might help out We've got two temples of Isis here already. Right. It's going to take an extra three food. Hmm. We're going to lose food from there as well. We're not getting any trade out of Antioch. Where's our trade coming through? Or through Alexandria, right? Yep. So we definitely need the trade port there. Should we go and convert this port over here? Yeah, I think we will. That's going to hit that public order. It's going to be a level three. Let's disband it or demolish it. I think a level two would be fine there. Okay. Who's this agent here, Serenica? All right. See if you can do something about her. You failed. Thirty-five percent, sixty-two percent. Oh, and you've been wounded. She must be pretty tough. Uh, Serenica is just sailing around in the East Mediterranean, not doing too much. Right. Armenia and Bactria, Saba and Bactria, okay. Cavalry stables, what can we get there now? Armored Desert Cavalry. We can already get our artillery. 
Now right, you do have 20 units, swordsmen. I don't think there's any mercenaries hiding in here. Armoured Desert Cav, 123 upkeep, it's not too bad. Hmm. Our melee attack isn't as good as them. Or your weapon damage. Defense is better. Armor is better. Your health is better than theirs. Base morale. Three. They're not all that much better than the Ethiopian Cav. Right. Who is unfriendly towards us? Yeah. Looks like even Macedonia is starting to come around. Really don't want to push out into West Africa or Italy or Dalmatia, Illyria. We want to focus over here. Perhaps we'll go after Saba. Because they're at war with Persia, slaves and Seleucids and Armenia. Yeah, we are trading with them, 364, hmm, well they have a nice bit of territory that we can go after. Yeah, I think we'll do that after we get the public orders situation taken care of. We are going to have to keep that army stationed in roads. Deal with those uprisings. Either that or just get rid of that territory. Okay. Non-aggression. And you're going to pay me for it. Fine by me. Natural causes. Okay, economic intent. As your dominions grow, the need to fill your coffers increases. Of the many lucrative endeavours open to you, which seems most profitable? Driving trade. Uh, Ten wealth from oil commerce. Five percent tariff increase. Okay, natural causes. That was our queen. Where is she? Slave revolt imminent. Increasing rank. Why have we come over to um, Cornwall or Devon? Our queen wasn't married to anyone, was she? Okay. Don't know why we're over there. Athens and Macedon increasing rank. Right. Syracuse and Galatia at war. Infantry quarters. Yep. Can we actually get any more armies? Summary. Yep, we can get one more army. Hmm. Right. Let's try again to kill her off. Enemy wounded. Uh, got rid of her for a while. Uh, 
Alright, go and get some food. Yeah, looks like we're going to have to keep that army there. Military presence and characters. That's 22. So we need some more um, research. See what we can finish off. Um, it does benefit land units. Poisoned arrows. Naples building of settlement. Blacksmith. Pre-siege tortoise. Battering ram. Hmm. That might come in useful for when we go and attack Sava. Can't finish that off. Yeah, let's actually go with that one and start building up an army. What's the best route to get to Saba? So the Seleucid fleet there. The Daemon. I don't have a great garrison. Tribes people are basic trash, navy skirmishers, got two good units there. Not sure if you can actually travel down here. Right. Where should we build the army up? Ptolemaeus Theron, perhaps. I can't see your effects or yours. Minus one corruption. Yeah. What are we going to have? I think some cavalry. And let's go ahead and upgrade you. And give you some household items. Eight morale for all units. Okay, we'll take that one. So, Desert Chariots. There's not many models in there. We can't get the artillery here. Ooh, got our Kushite archers. Leopard warriors. Chotel warriors. Hmm. Pikes. Swordsmen. Alright. As we haven't seen those, let's get someone into our army. Oh, there's a big increase in numbers. Right, six units you can get each turn. So, uh, three turns and you'll be ready to go. Well, four. I guess. We can always grab some mercenaries. Alright. Got 140,000, so we're doing okay. Uh, 
I think we're allied to most of the people that Saba is at war with. So there shouldn't be a problem there. Um, no, I'm not paying you. You are too far away. Okay, important character has risen to power. Okay. Ah, family tree. Looks like a lot of people have died off there. You could actually do with a wife, couldn't you? Seek spouse. Marriage. Good. Right. Send a gift. Well, we have the money. We don't need to do household items for... Oh, we actually do. What's that one for? Can't we select that one? Ah, we've already maxed it out. Okay. Right. Did that agent come back? Hope not. Let's send you, or we'll start sending you, towards the lands of Saba. You're going to be of use down here. If we can get you down here quickly enough. Uh, it's going to take a few turns. Let's activate you. Might as well activate you in practice and get you some more units. Right. Well, we may as well recruit some so we can actually see them in battle. Infantry quarters. All right. Armored Chotel warriors. Royal Kushite archers. Nice. All right. Let's check on the diplomacy. Make sure it's going to be all good when we attack Saba. Now, how's Bactria looking? Well, they're hostile in any case, so we're not going to worry about them. Persia. Slaves. Asimonies and Seleucids. Okay, let's talk to Persia. Hmm. Ah, you're a satrapy. Okay. Saba. Well, we're already allied to the Seleucids. Let's talk to Armenia. Twenty-two. I greet you in my master's feared name. Speak nope. in honesty, and you will be answered likewise. 
Oh, rejected. Alright. Fair enough. Let's see if we can get some trade going now. Your offer is fair and honourable. Ah, oh, they may come around over time. The guards will have me listen to you, but do not pass the day in words without merit. Lusitani. A flapping tongue that speaks without wisdom is not welcome. I do not think our people. Macedon. We are not known as patient people. They're How much trade? Welcome. Speak to the point. All right. I greet you in my master's feared name. Speak in honor, huh. and you will Devious. be answered likewise. Greetings. Now speak plainly, for we are an honest folk and value honor. Fine. Most kindly, for we have no. I am here to listen if you speak honestly. Truth will be your sharpest weapon. One sacrifice is. Give me trade as well. Our goodwill. I speak of gold, of course. I'll give you a thousand. No, oh, you rejected that. How much is trade with you worth? 219. They are treacherous. Alright. You can have that. Swaby. Greetings. Speak plain and you have my attention. Speak and try to do it well, for diplomacy is always boring when done badly. All right. Let's go ahead and concentrate on going to war with Saba. Uh. Do we have a non-aggression with them? Probably. Non-aggression and trade. Speak in honesty, and you will be answered. Yep. I see you have chosen a path. Now they're unhappy. End the turn. Right, we may have to build up a fleet as well, because this is the last army that we can actually have at our current Imperium. Unless we can pull an army out from somewhere else. Maybe Jerusalem or Tyros, maybe. Ah, uh, no trade with Gaetulii. Everyone is leveling up. The tones have been wiped out. Pontus. Let's see if we can talk to Pontus. Where are you, Pontus? Well, that's where you should be. Unknown region. Maybe they're not going to show up. No. We have to actually go and discover them. Even though we've just been told that they've been discovered. Alright. More missile firepower. There's a lot of trade out here, isn't there? Right, it's 13 units, We've got 4 spears, 3 cav, 3 chotel, we need some more missile units. Hmm. 
Let's get a couple of them at least. Swordsman. Chotels. Let's get some pikes. Four, five, six. That's 19 units. Probably some swordsmen. Okay, there's a force from Saba. What do we need over here? Desert Nomadic is going down. Okay, so if you can boost the culture, that would be useful. You're already converting. Alright, maybe a small conversion somewhere. Research. Ah, oh, yeah, right there. More cultural conversion. But we have to get up to that one. Right. And that spy also. Okay, that's plus 13. Can we pull you out from there? Ooh, is that plus 4? Yeah, we're going to get by. Uh, that's going to hit our public order, but that's going to fix it. Alright, so we can in fact move that army. Uh, do we have military access through Seleucids? Let's check with them. I'm pretty sure we do. The blessing of the Olympian military access, yep. Alright. Saba. Okay. So that's ours and that's ours. And we're going to try and claim all of Arabia Magna. Right. Let's go into Force March. We need to get down there as quickly as possible. What about over here? Can we pull out? Quite. Not quite. Poor food. Is it worth going for? Culture. I think we probably need to. 35 turns. We'll be okay. That's all Seleucid territory. We're going to need as many armies down there as possible. We position you here. Oh, you don't even need to. Yeah, you do. We'll position you right there. On the edge. Yeah, we need some sight over here. Uh, have we maxed out our... Spies, two or two, yes we have. We can have two more fleets. Right, well, that's where we're going to end it for this episode. Looks like in the next episode, we're going to be going to war with the Sarbans. So, till next time, thank you all for watching. Thank you for the likes, the comments, and the subscribers. And we'll see you later.